Welcome back to another episode of Stoppage Time One on One. We're joined by two giants ahead of our preview for the Manchester United he versus giants. Liverpool. He used to be a giant. He's supposed to say. Right. He used to be a giant. That monster he's been drinking. He used to be a giant. <laughs> <laughs> bro, can I ask you a question? Bro, go straight okay. into it. Go straight All right. into it. Yo, let's get How's straight your mental health, bro? How's mental, mental health? health? Great, fam. Bro, you <laughs> sure about that? You sure good. about that? I'm bro. looking at you. You ain't the camera you used to know, bro. Bro, you ain't the camera you used to know. Listen, okay, you hold on, hold on, hold on. Depression. Listen. I can, I, can recommend, I can recommend you to another clinic, you know, if you want to know. Bro, you ain't the camera you used to know, man. <laughs> all right, cool. Let's all right, all right, all right. Let's all right. set the scene. He's setting it. He's come out punching, boy. Liverpool, United, one of the biggest fixtures in the Premier League. <laughs> And this time it's on different <laughs> circumstances. We have one team who is on top of the league and we have another team that is in a bit of a higgy state. But it's a big game nevertheless. So, is the rivalry as big as it used to be? Do the fans still care about it? Is it important to you guys or is it just... It's, so it's always going to be a big rivalry. It's always going to be the biggest like general fixture in terms of size. It's always going to be the biggest. It's two most successful clubs in England. You know what I mean? Going head to head. So, and obviously kind of around the same region of england so there is that rivalry there it'll, ne it'll never go but i mean i don't know where this new energy came from because if i'm going through mental health you ain't seen your team win the title bro, so if i'm going bro, through mental health what bro, are you going through this is what's going on i've been going up i'm used to united dominating the league mm -hmm. we're talking 90s era 2000s yeah. early 2000s era your team are quality players. Now your team are full of like Tesco branded sausage rolls, bro. <laughs> Seriously, man. Listen, this, listen. This is what I'm trying to say. This is what I'm trying to say. The rivalry's been big from young. I got two Man United older brothers. They support Man United, yeah. I was being the only person that supports Liverpool. So growing up, no, it was must like have been pain. Yeah, it was pain. I'll be with you. I had to hold my own. Get me. I had to you hold my PTSD. own. I had to hold my own. You know what I'm saying? I can't even lie to you. This rivalry is big. When I mean big, like in a house, you used to have like punch ups and that. Like, so the rivalry is big. What about the actual fixture now? So the rivalry, like like you've both said, is probably the biggest in. Would you say it's the biggest yeah, in the It's the biggest fixture. It's, it's, the, the, biggest fixture fixture fixture. it's Fi the biggest fixture, as in fixture, as in historically, biggest in terms of historically, size. Historically, yeah. yeah. It's fixture now, we probably look at Man United, like we look at Leicester, look at Wolves, look at mm. Everton. It's not, they're not the same team. I mean, you can to, say that. They're not the same team. I used mean, to you be. can say that, but if and I tell you, if I tell you that since Ferguson left, you guys have only beaten us four times in 15 games, what does that mean? Because a game's a game, do you know no, what, but I mean? what does that a mean? A game's a game. If you look at us at Leicester, it's you guys... going to be a tough we, game. Since Fergie left, we have still beat you more times than you've beaten us. So what bro, does that mean about you? Bro, that's what does that about mean? Being, what I'm trying to say, Premier has got 38 games, bro. Old Trafford is going to be I difficult. thought we are talking about one game right now. No, we're talking... I thought we are talking about one game. Yeah, but we're talking about one game, but we're talking about... Let's talk about the league, right? The league's got 38 games. If you pull go to Old Trafford, yeah, it's always going to be a difficult game, no matter what. We might have beaten you, you beating us. Mm -hmm. It's never been a thrash. You never thrashed us at 5 0. We never thrashed you at 6 0. The games mm -hmm. are mostly tight, right? Mm -hmm. So, what my, but you my can't beat us. My point, my point is, my point is, going into Old Trafford, it's going to be a difficult game. I don't like the motherfuckers, but going to Old Trafford is <laughs> going to be a difficult game. They're going to be up for it. Their mm -hmm. fans are going to be up for it. Even though they've been playing like rubbish all season, mm -hmm. it's going to give them uplift. They're playing Liverpool. We're at the top of the league. We're unbeaten. So, putting that all aside, all the passion. It's gonna be a good game. I can see that we've given him trauma over the years. I can see it because trauma. I can see the energy. You see us? Yeah, we're going for a bad moment, but I'm mellow. I'm you know calm. I'll be honest you, with you, you're hyped you're up. Right. You're psyched you're right. up because right. you guys are you're tired right. of being the bully. You're okay, right. bullied. You're right. It's you know true. what I mean? I can't so even I lie to you. You're right. You know what? Going through primary school, mm -hmm. I had to defend my own. You know what I'm saying? Man United fans used to dominate the playground. I sleep like a baby. Ferguson, I can't lie. Ferguson has made so much Man United fans like so much like people my age group mm. yeah our age group support my united because of ferguson what he's done mm. i'm not going to deny you lot have dominated the league you've won the league three times in a row twice you've done a treble like applause well done for that well, right I will now, take we're talking that. about 2019 mm -hmm. and so you haven't on, won the league in seven years point. you haven't competed in seven years you, you haven't, haven't won the league either the best thing you you've haven't done won in seven years either. is get to quarterfinals of champions league but so so you on, haven't won it point you're raising <laughs> you guys ain't won it either. that leads to my next question have we seen a role reversal with the fans? Because what it seems to be today is, if you look at Liverpool a few years ago, it was kind of history, history, history. We won the Champions League, hey? mm. we won Europe, um, UEFA Cup, hen. Yeah. It was all about kind of historical elements. Have we seen a swap in the fans where that's what United fans are doing now and Liverpool fans are talking about the present? Or is this just hundred percent? I don't. I don't see many United 100%. fans. Yeah, talk. we do, we know what we are 100%. right now. You know what I mean? We don't talk about oh when we last won the league. Blah 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 blah. That was that was a long oh. time ago. We know that oh. we've literally 
it's pre it's post Fergie. We say that it's post Fergie. We know we know what we've gone through. Yeah, you know I mean we know mm. what we're doing right now. With you guys, I've seen Liverpool win the Champions League before. I've never seen you win the title. You've never seen your Bro, team win we, the title. We, wait, 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 wait. You've I never can't. seen it, yeah? I've seen I've seen you guys win the Champions League before. So this isn't something new. I've seen Liverpool in 2005 win the Champions League. You guys are getting on this crazy, crazy high horse right now. I'm not now, getting on crazy high horse. I'm, I'm realistic. Last season, I'm realistic. you guys had the realistic. chance. I know you're not confident right now that you're going to win the league. Bro, I'm are confident. You guys, I don't think Bro, you're confident. I'm confident. Because you've seen your talk. team bottle it. Every talk. title race you've had. Not, not you Bro, we bought it twice. Bro, I'm not going to lie to you. I'm not going to lie to you, yeah? I'm not going to lie to you. As as a club, yeah, the last few seasons we've been doing well, we're competing. Before, we'll say like, before 2013, we're talking from your era of Ferguson, where they're dominating the league, we were nowhere to be seen. I'm not going to sit here and be like, raw, Liverpool have always been competing for league. That's bullshit. Mm -hmm. I'm here to tell you that, to answer your question about the whole, uh, if Man United are the same team as it used to be before, and also talk about how all these pundits are my United's ass talking about oh the ninety twos era. We've got Neville, the Liverpool we've got Gary media, Neville, media is Liverpool. Soon as talking about you got my United media as well though. As but well. The, the uh, Liverpool run the media. You got people that work here that come in the media as well. It's my United. And as he well. spits people talk realness. about my United. He's well. realness. You yeah, lot, you, you have read that. You have talking all these about. You got people it. talking about ninety twos era. Talking about how great my United centre backs were. You talking mm. about Pedersen. We're talking about Bruce. We're talking about the old seven, old eight area. We're talking about Village. Talking about Ferdinand. His and look at your centre backs right now, Maguire. The only thing Maguire can use is a big fucking forehead. <laughs> That's the only thing he can use right Ma now. Maguire starts for Liverpool. Do you know how fast? Do you know how far Ma you've Maguire dropped starts standards Liverpool. wise? Maguire starts for Liverpool. This is why I'm talking about your mental health. Do you know how far you dropped standards wise? Our standards Bro, have dropped. You've gone from but having world beaters yeah. to punks in mm -hmm. your team. That's a fact. Seriously. That's a fact. You're and right. That, and that's going to hurt you, bro. The I know it's going to hurt you. You're right. I know it's going to hurt you. But I can health, see. Bro. Probably, I your can girl probably even link you right now. <laughs> I know. So, I can see you're very excited. I'm not excited. I'm you're, just telling you. You're very realness. excited at what Liverpool is going on. But if I ask you, if I ask you directly, if you think your club's going to win the league, you can't say. I got wait, wait, wait. You can't say hand in hand that you think you can. Because let me tell you why. You know what I'm you why? 09, what happened? You guys could have won the league. You guys lost the least games that season. Did you win the league? No, you didn't. You bottled. Did you oh, win the league? We'll wait, wait, wait. We'll 2013. 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 We'll I'm, even finished. I'm not even finished. In midfield. I'm not even finished. We've had Joe Allen in midfield. Listen, listen. Jared's carried us. He's even, even won as a trophy. I'm not even finished. Has Pogba done that to your I'm team? I'm not even finished. I can't compare Pogba and Jared. I've got a list. Jared's list. carried us. Listen, Pogba's right, let me finish. Let me finish. Yeah? And you can compare McTonnery to Jay Spear and let me, Joe Allen. They're all the same players. You know what I mean? Eighteen, 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 of course he did. And what we happened? Clear. What happened? I want to hear you say it. What happened? We slipped up and we drew. You slipped. That's we ironic. We drew against West Ham. That's ironic. We drew against West Ham. We drew against ironic. Leicester. Bro. Okay. Wait, wait. 18, 19. Bro. And then now last this season. season now last this season, season wait, wait, wait. was a fluke. Now this season. Last season was a now fluke. Now this season. You can't even wait, call wait. it a bottle drop. Because last season was a fluke. 97 fluke. points. The second oh, highest tally. The second highest tally in the Premier League history. I'm sorry. Liverpool. Bro. City went and got 100 City. when they wanted to win the league. Bro. You guys City's, should have got that. God has come to the league. Let's talk facts. God has come to the league. He's made the league another level. Did Guardiola he's make made, you guys draw 1-1 against Everton? He didn't. He didn't. Guardiola didn't do that. He's made the rival teams have to step up the game. We know now to win the league. You've got to win majority of the games. We're talking. I've given you over three examples games. of when you've we're bottled the league. Over 30 That's games. why you can't tell bro, me you're going to win. If my team, were eight I, points I'm, clear. I'm if my team, wait. If my know. team, let me finish. Let me finish. If my team were eight points clear, I'll be able to say we're going to win the league. Yeah, you no, can't say you it can't because say you're scared. Because you're scared. Been competing seven years. Why are you talking about eight points? It's because you're scared. Been competing eight years. Why are you talking about seven points clear? Let's go back to today. So that's historical. Let's go back to today. I'm going to ask you each question each because not just Fred's ask Cam a question. So Cam. If Oli was to get a win in this victory, are you still Oli out? Absolutely. Absolutely. That would be good for him. But why are you lying for? I swear last season we were talking about Oli Rule, bro. Yeah, Ollie I will. Hey, the, only, the only rule I know about is the London Live. I don't know about no Oli <laughs> Rule, bro. I listen, don't know about no Oli Rule. You were shouting Oli Rule when, when Ola Soak said was 13 points. Wow. 13 we, games. We, we 13 know. games on beating your shot. You're right. That Ollie look, look in
same points ahead again from last season. If you weren't to win it this season, if you, w- were, well, if you weren't to win the Prem this season, how would you feel about that? It's a failure. It's a failure, especially, like I said before, in the other um, episode, we were eight points clear. And City have got defensive issues. Yeah, Their best defender, Laporte, he's not... He's he's injured, so they have got defensive issues. Yeah, Stones is injured, and you're still not They're confident that you win it. I'm co- listen. I see we got a good chance. You never know what could happen. You know what I'm saying? City could buy a, City could buy a centre back in January. They could change and their game. But that, that, that centre back, that that back going, doesn't stop City you guys in your through, individual City's games. still going through attacking wise. They're still good attacking wise. Just defensively, they're still creating chances. They're still scoring a lot of goals. Just defensively, I guarantee they need to you. shut up. I guarantee you. If City, I guarantee you. If City so I still think we've got a good chance. To answer the question, answer the question. What you're saying? Answer the question. What you're saying? I believe that. Um, yeah, I believe. What was the question again? I said they're so hot. They don't know. I said they don't know. How would you feel if you were not to win the league this season? Yeah, I think it'll be yeah. I said, I think it'll be a failure. It'll be a failure. We've got to win the league this season. We expected to win the league this season, especially. I don't think you expect care. it. Especially, you don't sound like especially you going through the experience you've gone through last season. It's going to break us. It's <laughs> going to break as, us as because long we've as got you know. so close to win the league, one point away from Man City. We've gone through that experience. Okay, cool. We've had a couple of years ago. We had an, another uh, close experience to win the league. We've mm. gone through that experience where we know we've got to now win the league. Our, fi- our fans want it so much, so we've got to go for it now. And if we don't win a league this season, I'd it's want a it too. It's but 30 years. I'd want it too, mate. Bro, I'd want that too. Bro, you I'd, in I'd, seven I'd years, be bro. desperate you for in if it was years. 30 years. You're going through, you can't deny you're going through a massive, massive We're going through a decline. Stage, bro. We're going through a failing you're, you're, you're absolutely right. You're absolutely so right. But you been it's not nowhere, as bad. It's nowhere been, near as bad been, as what you've gone through. That's it. You haven't been nowhere near in the league. It's not as bad as what you've gone through. You should be giving me advice how to cope with this. You should be giving me advice. I sh- you should be I'm my therapist. You, get you should be my therapist. Go, go to your therapist. Get cold, more man. That's is that what you did? That's what I'm giving you. Is that what you did? I'm giving you is that, that advice. Is that what you did? Advice. I know your mental health is really bad. Is that what you did? I know your mental health is really bad at that moment, bro. Listen, before we go into the fix, it's hard, you know. Hold on, hold on, say it's hard. It's hard, you know. Knowing that man, knowing that man United, knowing that man United, best, knowing that man United, that's for drugs. I don't know, you know, knowing that man United's best chance is probably to win the FA Cup to get to your league this season. Because you're probably gonna finish eighth, but. You know as well. It's so tight. The question, the question tight. I had before yeah. we go into the big question, which is the mixed 11, is there was a period underneath uh, Roy Hodgson at Liverpool where Roy Hodgson came out and said Liverpool could be in a relegation battle. Where do you rank that compared to where United are at the moment? Would you say that United are in the worst stage than that? Or would we're you say in a ba- Liverpool were far worse than we're? We're in a bad stage, but these guys need to remember where they came from. You know course, what I mean? Like, of course. You're get, said, yeah, said they, as I said, like they're I getting said too happy. Gone, they're getting I'm too, too happy. Get, you, you sound I've admitted we've gone happy. through a lot of pain. I've gone through a lot of pain, bro. Yeah, listen, listen, I've, listen I you got to tell, understand. I, I live know. in a Man United predominant household, bro. <laughs> Man United predominant household. So I've gone through them days. Tight. I've gone through the days where we've had like, like Jay Spear and Joe Allen, Lucas, mm. Dirk Kite up front, Babble in the rings. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Crap team, whatever you want to call it. That's what we're going through. You want to call it. But, but you guys were, have been in a worse state. All I'm saying is we're oh. going through a bad state, but we we know this. There's no, we know it, 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 it's it's bad times. But you you seem a bit uncertain if you're gonna win titles. You don't no, bro, you I don't know really gonna, know. Bro, I know you don't really know. Titles. That's bro, what I'm this, saying. This, this, like, this, this is this is the era of I don't think I don't think right. So X Ferguson era when mm-hmm. you dominated the league. I don't think will happen in the future. I think mm-hmm, it's gonna I be agree. it's gonna be different areas where Man City might dominate, Liverpool might dominate. I don't think it's gonna be. Complete so dominance of dominate. 10 years. It is our time to dominate now. It is our time to dominate. Mm. We've, we've, we've been competing for the last two, three years now. So we've gone close to winning the league last season. We're eight points clear this season. We've got our head screwed on. We know what we've been there before. So we're going to go for it this season. And we're going to cool. go and. I respect that. Let's go. Get the trophy. Mixed 11. Bro, I think the first time in stoppage time history, all 11 plays at Liverpool. Straight up. This is when they're getting. This is straight when they're high. All this 11 is when they're high. All 11 players, Liverpool. Tell you me one player. Tell 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 me on paper, it's supposed to be Pogba. better than, than Jordan Henderson. Who's performed better over the is, two seasons? Is Jordan Henderson better than Pogba? On form, is he better than Pogba? He performed better. Pogba, Pogba played better than him last season, bro. In the better league. Better than Jordan Henderson. Was Pogba not better in the team of the year? Was Pogba not in the team of the year? 
The guy was in the team of the year. Got a vendetta against Pogba, thinking that he's he can create stuff and can they be. They hate Pogba. They uh, hate him. Yeah, so yeah, why he... is he in the team of the year, bro? Come on, man. Oh, this this nah. being shit's been. All right, let's start and go. Let's start and go. Let's start and go. Goalkeeper. Goalkeeper. The hater. The gayer. The hater. The guy that can't even get into the Spain team right now. Where's Alisson? Well, He's injured. He's injured. We're not talking about. We're not talking about form right now. It's current, yeah. So yeah, no, that's fair point. One season, one season of Alisson. Because I know you were not watching him at Roma. Oh, I was so, watching him at Roma. No, so one I season, one season, one season of Alisson is gonna eclipse. It's not one. It's not one season, bro. He's been hey, good the at Premier Roma. League team of the He's decade just came out, and De Gea was in it. Yeah, and now you're trying to put him out because of because of De is a world class keeper. Listen, we gotta understand. De Gea has come to the league. Yeah, he's come to the league, and this first season. He was pants. He was he wasn't good. Mm-hmm. His first, I remember strikers at Crouch, that remember year, strikers like uh, Andy Carroll. They used to target him in corners. Mm-hmm. So from that, you know, from going from a weak the keeper, keeper, weak vulnerable keeper to coming to world's class keeper, becoming yeah. one of the best keepers ever out Is, there. Would he not be in the current team right now in terms of form? I wouldn't put him in the current team. I wouldn't put him. He can't even get into Spain's current team. That bad boy Kepa for Chelsea. He's, he he's, do in the, he's in the Kepa is but he's better than Kepa though. But Kepa he's is better than Kepa. For Spain, he's not he's good. Be- I, I, Listen, I, know I, know, I know. I know. I know the game. Neither is Kepa. Kepa. But we're going for form, and I don't <laughs> think form-wise, he's making too many but mistakes. But Alisson's not even gonna play anyway. Alisson's fit right now. He's is he, he gonna play? He's gonna play. Adrian's gonna play, man. Alisson's gonna play. Even if Alisson can potentially start, even if Alisson can potentially start, he's gonna be ahead of the game at the moment. Even if Alisson's fit, yeah. I don't get twisted. Alisson's a top keeper, one of the best in the world, yeah. But you can't ignore what the hell has done, bro. I'm not ignoring that. You can't ignore that. I'm not ignoring that. I'm saying to you, he's been your best player for the last five years. Team of the best. Team of the decade. He's been your best player for the last five years. That shows how your team is, by the way, as well. Having your goalkeeper being your best player for Mm. the last five, six years. That's true. That's ridiculous. But anyways, (laughs) to talk about the girl. Listen, he's done... Magnificent stuff. Mm-hmm. I'm not denying that. I'm not saying on present form. The last I'm season, to he made me. too many dis- cool. he made too many. We'll mistakes. call that one. We'll leave that one to the fans then. Left I mean, back. I think we're talking about who's better, right? We're talking about better. Who's better. We can we're talk about who's better. But when we've done it, it's been better. in no, terms of do, if, if you were to pick the squad on Saturday, mm. who who are you picking, bro? bro that doesn't make Alison Becker straight. All right, bro. I'm going cool. cool. left back. Left back. Andy Robertson. Yeah. Center halves. Van Dijk and Matip. Van Dijk and Maguire. Maguire. Maguire, yes. Maguire. Yes, Maguire. Oh, you're smoking. Ginger. Nah, bro. Maguire. I'm going Maguire over Matip. I think Matip is a very good defender, but he's a, he's a second. So he's, 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 he's a one he's a two, Matip, he's a two. What's Maguire better Matip at? Headering. He's, be, he's, a, he's a better header. I think he's better in the tackle. 360's got a zero tolerance to drugs, man. This guy's but, <laughs> mad. This guy's even mad. I think I think he's I think he's better head right. He's better. He's more aggressive. He's better in the tackle, and he's been Bro, he, he he leads. He, spent, he leads. He, he leads defense. He leads defense. Eighty million on a defender, and I can tell you, all your great past teams, the guy would even get into the bench. That's You're telling me. You know, you know why? Jonathan because you know why? Because you get. You tell me better Jonathan Woods get. Would, would Matip? Bro, would Matip. Matip. I'm, I'm, gonna I'm, gonna I'm, gonna, I'm not going to deny it. I'm going to deny it. You guys were losers. I'm not going to deny Matip. I'm not going to deny Matip. I'm not going to deny Matip being our best ever centre back in our whole whatever. Our whole, um, you know what I'm saying? But I'm, tr- I'm trying to say that right now, Matip. He's a two. He's a two. Right now, Matip, in terms of form and what he can produce, right now, he's got to be in that team. Maguire, I, I, I'm, Maguire, going Maguire. Maguire, I'm going Maguire. I'm going Maguire. He makes too many mistakes. United have only conceded. You know, tight. listen, United, yeah, as you're talking about your he's greatness. Not, wait, 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 over, wait, 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 wait. Overrated. Hold player. on. They're right, only wait. rating him because he's English. Listen, if you're Maguire was from another country, if he was, if he was, from, if he was Spanish or if he was Italian, you would not spend eighty million on him. Listen, because you're trying to bring a new philosophy of, of, of bringing English players into your I team. Can hear you. I that's can why. Hear that, but that's why it doesn't dispute about the player. We're just talking about the player. Look at even Let's go about the other game. Even in England, he's making mistakes. Wait, wait. Forget about his feet. Yeah, forget about that. We're just talking about who I'm, we're talking about. We're talking about the players. Yeah, mm-hmm. United have come in. We've conceded nine goals. You guys have conceded six goals. I yeah. think it is this season. Yeah? yeah, but you've got Van Dijk. You've got Matic there. We've got we've got Lindelof. We've got things. Oh, doesn't Maguire's matter. Come doesn't and matter. Well. If you want to come, you can't come no, and no, say no, no, he's no, done no. shit. No, but he's done okay. He he's done, he's he's done, done okay. Goals. Our he's issue done, is scoring goals. Done, so are you guys are you guys undecided between who you're going to pick? Can't deny Liverpool's defense was crap before Van Dijk come. We were conceding. Yeah, how, how Van Dijk is the big dog. Wait, Van Dijk's Van coming. Dijk dog. Van Dijk's coming and it's completely changed our defence. That's why Maguire he's the best. is supposed to come in and That's do why similar. He's the best. You didn't spend eighty million bro, for we're, Maguire we're, we're in to come in. Than you but you, you didn't spend. You didn't spend. Away. You didn't spend eighty million for Maguire to come and do okay. Cool. So we're Maguire, Matip, Bonsho. Matip brings in 
even on sure? so no, I'm bigger than Matip. I'm bigger. Bigger than Matip. Matip was there, Matip was there before than... Van Dijk. He needed Van Dijk to save his bacon. No, nah, he was there before, but he wasn't obviously was performing as good as before. Happening? You were finishing below Bro, Manchester United. Well, I'm just saying you've talking. you've bought oh, you've mate. bought you spent 80 million yeah mm-hmm. on a centre back not to be okay. United. Not to be all right. We've to hope to be the captain, to be the leader. So your team lacks leadership skills. Let us know where you're going. Maguire goals. or Matip. Right back. You are Trent. happy. Hold on. Trent. Right I need to go back. Trent. You are happy Trent. to put Rudiger over Matip, but you're yeah, complaining I said about Ma- potentially. Maguire. Potentially. I said potentially. Rudiger's a better defender than Maguire. Let's run this right. back. Let's run this back. Rudiger's a better defender than Maguire. Rudiger's a better defender than Maguire. You're a Rudiger's a better defender than Maguire. Right back. My son. Go on. Right back. Right back, Trent. This guy was going to put Aspie. This guy was going to put Aspie the other day. Aspie's you are going to put Aspie Aspie's and now you're going to put Wan-Bissaka. Do, do, do you know what your exact reason? Wan-Bissaka's a good defender. Let me tell you what your reason but was. Trent is a, Let me tell you Trent what your reason. Trent's better reason, than him. Your reason for vouching for Aspie was because he's a better defender. He's yeah? a better defender. Who's a better defender? Trent or Wan-Bissaka? I will say, at the moment, I'll say Trent is a better defender. It's close. I'm going to deny and say wan is way better defender than Trent. He, he saying, defends better than Wan-Bissaka. Trent's a good defender. He's a bit. He's a bit. Do you know our system? Do you know our system? How our wingers do not. Our wingers do not go back, and defend. Our wingers don't defend and go back. We leave so much space. Yeah. If you actually attack us, our wingers don't go back and defend. Money don't go back and defend. Salah don't go back and defend. There's so much space on. Sometimes our midfielders are out of position. I'm bemused. And. And <laughs> bemused. I said bemused. I'm bemused. <laughs> I, said, you know <laughs> I am <laughs> bemused. I'm bemused. Bro, Trent can defend. He might, be the, he might not be the best defender, but he can defend. He can definitely defend. Bro. He can definitely defend. Wan Bissaka is in a bro. different league no, to different. Trent he's not, he's not as a different. defender. He's a different league, bro. He's not a different league. Trent is the Trent. best attacking fullback probably in bro, the league. We're talking, about attacking, we're talking about attacking defensively, right? To, to, to build, build your argument and say he's better. Attacking wise, he's it's way Trent. ahead. And defensive wise, Wan Bissaka potentially is way better potentially than potentially is close enough to Trent. So what does that make? as a better right back. Trent, what? if he's way better attacking You're wise, this up. I'm not making this You're up. Making this what up. is a right back? You're making this what up. What has a right back got to do in this modern day of football? He's got to attack, create he's, chances. And he's got to defend me. There's so much. There's so much emphasis. There's so much emphasis. You know so there's so much emphasis on on teams on their team's fullbacks to go out and create chances, right? Teams play against Liverpool and football. they say let's attack Trent. Attacking wise, Trent is good going good forward. Defensively, he might not be the best defensively, but I still think he's a better defender than Ramba Are you guys he's undecided about this one as well? That's cat. He's What's your final point? Are you undecided Bro, then? He's talking about I need to go on what his reasoning was. I just told you the reason. I just told you the reason. For this 32 year old bad guy, you were vouching for him because he did defense. Mad. And now you're you saying Wan Bissaka. You're saying Wan Bissaka. You're talking about Trent. I'm rushing, I'm rushing, is a better defender than Wan Bissaka. Defensive wise. Defensive wise, Aspi Kutu is a good defender. Wan Bissaka is a better defender than both of them. We'll leave that for now. Midfield free. I'm going for Henderson, Ronaldo, and Fabinho. This is just blasphemy. This is just blasphemy. Man's using some next This is just blasphemy, bro. Pogba like, is in the team. Stop bro, acting up, bro. Stop acting, acting up. Bro, I'm you're acting up. up. Bro, you're moving mad. Fabinho, Pogba, mad. and Wijnaldum. Bro, we had your Polish, no, we had no, your Polish no, today. No, no, Seriously, no, no, you're moving no, no, crazy. No, no, not Wijnaldum. Wait, 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 let me think. Okay, Actually, go, go Wijnaldum. Wijnaldum. Both Wijnaldum. Both so Actually, Wijnaldum. I don't know. You Sky Henderson? Yes, I'm Sky Henderson. Bro, why would you choose Pogba or Henderson? I know, I know Pogba. I know, listen, I'm saying paper-wise, paper-wise. We're talking two years ago, Pogba's coming to the team. Man United spent over nearly 100 million on Pogba. He's supposed to be the leader. He's supposed to carry the team. He's supposed to be talented, the most talented players um, in the league. He's supposed to be the world-class player that he was at Juventus. So I'm talking about form-wise right now. What you has know, he done? You know Pogba, what has he done? Pogba part, contrib- part, of, part of school, many penalties. Pogba what has he done? contributed to over what 20 goals done? for Man United last most season. Most of them penalties. He was our top, most goal, was our top assist. I don't want to hear that. He most of them penalties. He was our top goal scorer. He was our top assist. Scoring penalties. He was, how many goals in the league did he penalties. get? How many? He got about, for what, 12? 12. 12. 12. 12. 12. He was listen, in the team of the year. I don't even want to get No matter how bad Pogba is, he's better than Jordan Henderson. I know. Listen, I'm talking about... He's better than Wijnaldum as well. Don't get it twisted. I'm talking about... Yes, paper wise, he might be better. T- might be best. Form, he's but on form, no. Bad Paul Pogba is form. is still the set is a better level than Jordan we'll leave Henderson. Leave that undecided as well. Front three. Paul, 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 Paul Pogba doesn't make. Front three talks to myself. Ridiculous. Front three talks. Paul Pogba wouldn't make it into the Liverpool team. Front three. Front three talks for itself. Front three. Yeah. Cool. Front three talks for itself. One sentence answers. Who are the key players and why? Go. 
key player for you. In the, in that <laughs> Yo, game. going into a Liverpool game, it's probably gonna have to be because I don't even know who's gonna be playing, bro. Um, gonna have to be our defense again. We're gonna have to say one player. I'll probably say it's gonna have to be Maguire. Not James. I had and to why? say Maguire. I had to say Maguire last time against. Yeah. Um, who was it against? Arsenal. Against Arsenal. I'm gonna have to say Maguire again because he's our best defender. And we're gonna need to. We're gonna be defending. I know that. How James, maybe even the say James. How about Liverpool? James isn't this. He's not. He's not that good. How why, about, why do you mind that fans think he's a new Van Giggs? Hmm? Because he's Welsh, I guess. Because no, he's Welsh. Because how about Liverpool? Welsh. And this is probably interesting because ultimately, if we look at your front three mm. in terms of the league, it's not been what we saw last year. So who would you say is the one player that, that needs to stand up for you? That front Firmino. three don't even really do bits against Firmino. Manchester United. For me, no. That front three don't really Firmino's do bits. Bit. You know and that. Why, and why is it Firmino? Why is Firmino the because most important player for this game? Firmino's the main person that links up with Salah, um, Salah Mane. He's the main person that comes in deep, links up with the play. And if he's not playing well, the other, front, other uh, Mane Salah obviously tend to not to play well as well. So, so Maggie versus Firmino. What's Salah's record against Man United? Salah's, yeah, he hasn't scored a lot of goals against Man United. Even yeah, last, he hasn't, he hasn't scored. Last year, even last year, he was shocking. He was shocking us. I even remember one time Ram Mato even tackled, tackled him, him <laughs> in the one-on-one. Yeah, he was yeah, shocking yeah, us. Yeah, yeah. I'll give cool. you that. Like, Mane last scored year. the other day, but as well. Bro, you got a wife. You got a wife. You got a wife for your defenders, though. As I said, your as I said head to head, as I said, there. head to head, you guys don't do that. Your well defenders cool. not... Let's go. Final question. Score predictions. Where are we going? You know, as I want this to be Ole's last game in charge. I'm gonna say two 0 to Liverpool. I'm gonna say two 0 to Liverpool. But that'll be a big shot because again, as I said, you guys don't really beat us. But yeah, I think do you know what? I think it'll be a tough game. Man. I think, especially after the international break, Liverpool have to win. If you guys lose have to, to us win. at this point, of course you have to win. Because don't show your face again. No, I'll show my face, bro. Show face I always again. show my face. I show my face for the dark times <laughs> when my night was dominating the league. My brother used stick it on me. I'll show my face then. So, Say no more. Um, I think it'll be a tough game. I think it'll be two one Liverpool. Cool. Do we get a handshake? Yeah, man. Come on, man. Make nah, sure you nah, nah. <laughs> make sure you check out the rest of Stoppage Time TV. That's another episode of Stoppage Time One One. We're out. <laughs>